two squads from 16th Sustainment Brigade and 18th Military Police Brigade represented Team 21 in the best squad competition for U.S. Army Europe and Africa in Grafenbeer. Women's Equality Day was commemorated at Simbach, and our Commanding General, Major General James Smith, issued the Oath of Enlistment to 16 female soldiers that re-enlisted at the ceremony. Guest speaker, Colonel Caprissa Brown Slade, described the efforts women made in society and in the military for equality and mentioned the female-led organizations that are ongoing today. 21st Special Truth Battalion hosted an organizational day for their soldiers, civilians, and families at Dana Cassern. 18th Military Police Brigade soldiers attached to Kosovo Force Reserve Component East Task Force conducted an explosive detection demonstration with military working dogs. 635th Transportation Detachment, 39th Transportation Battalion, 16th Sustainment Brigade, assisted 598th Surface Deployment and Distribution Command with port operations in Greece and Denmark to bring Combat Aviation Brigade 1st Armored Division equipment into the European theater. Also, 624th Movement Control Team, 39th Transportation Battalion supported Resolute Castle 22 by uploading cargo onto the USNS Mondanka in Alexandrupoli, Greece. First Inland Cargo Transfer Company, 39th Movement Control Battalion performed joint force training with the United States Air Force to sustain readiness and prepare for future operations. 23rd Ordnance Company, 18th Combat Sustainment Support Battalion Firefighters put out wildland fires with the United States Army Garrison Bavaria German Firefighting Partners. 23rd Ordnance Company also performed construction engineer training with dozers, building a forward ammunition supply point. 18th Combat Sustainment Support Battalion conducted a field exercise to train soldiers on preventive maintenance checks and services, night driving, and ground guiding in Grafenbeer. Thanks for watching Team 21's August Highlights. First in support, Stronger Together.